Gorkha. Gorkha, the name Gorkha is located in the district, the uh, west of Kathmandu. Uh, initially, uh, Gorkha army, the, the people who fought for the protection of Gorkha, Gorkha a nation, it was initially a nation, Gorkha, and uh, they fought for Gorkha, uh, and they even extended their territory. Gorkha army was very much strong at that time, and uh, it was uh, uh, in 17th century, and Prithibi Narayan Saha, the, uh, the, the, the forefather of uh, this uh, king, uh, this present king, right? And the Prithviraj Saha, who uh, was the leader, and uh, he uh, he extended his territory uh, up to uh, western part of Nepal and eastern part of Nepal, uh, and uh, they uh, he, he consolidated uh, Nepal, uh, consolidated the territory of Nepal, and uh, made the unified Nepal, and then after uh, Gorka uh, and. Uh, what the uh, Britishers uh, keep in their mind, oh, Gorkha, Gorkha are so brave. And in that background, uh, uh, and uh, in, in that background, uh, 1815's war was fought. And later, they, uh, the Gorkhali gave uh, uh, very good impressions to Britishers. Uh, and uh, in, uh, in second phase war, they also influenced by Gorkhas. Oh yes, because Hill people, these Gorkhas fought very, very bravely. Because we have so many sophisticated weapons in the war. We, we just uh, deploy in each and every sections. But they only they fight for the nations only for their, uh, you see, uh, uh, using the uh, uh, natural uh, resources in their using their uh, uh, internal desire uh, against the enemy. So they impress. And in, in that two cases, Britishers gave the space for uh, young Gorkhali people to, to uh, uh, bring into their army. And they made uh, the different sections. Gorkha, uh, and Gorkha army in the whole and uh, within this army they made many sections and uh, uh, some of the sections even now uh, working in uh, UK mm. and uh, some of the sections even now working in India. Mm. 